A master plan to renovate the state docks building at Ditto Landing was announced back in October, and now new renderings are available to show what that vision will look like. Arkin McCoy spoke with Madison County Commissioner Phil Riddick and gives us a peek. We're going to kind of combine uh, the Barron's Bluff at, at Bird and Mars Music Hall and City Harbor, kind of roll all those things into one, and that's what we're going to have down there. The dream of turning one of South Huntsville's gyms into one of the city's main attractions took a little time. It takes a while to do things like this, and there's been some impediments that have caused this to take as long as it has. But uh, we're, we've worked through a lot of that stuff, and... Uh, uh, we're moving forward with it. Ditto is, has been called a diamond in the rough for a long time. There's been a lot of people down here that have wanted to see uh, that property developed and something happened to it. It's kind of Huntsville's own only riverfront. So, we, you know, we want to see something nice happen down there. Back in October, Commissioner Phil Riddick announced a major renovation project on the landing. And now we can finally see what that vision looks like. What the county is doing right now is we're going to renovate uh, the existing state docks building down there. We're going to add some facilities to it plus renovate the building that's there. So there's a large 20,000 square foot building there. It's just kind of a warehouse shell. We're going to turn that into an event space. And then on the front, we've got some uh, open spaces that we hope will be uh, restaurant venues. So uh, we're really looking forward to that. The space will be more than a place for entertainment. This is going to be a venue that can be rented out for corporate events, for seated dinners. Uh, you know, we don't have a lot of venues here in town that are affordable that you can rent and have a you know 600 person seated dinner. So, you know, and this will be right there on the river. So it's, it's not just for entertainment, but, you know, corporate events, maybe small trade shows. That's the beauty of the of the venue that it's going to have multiple purposes. For Fox 54 News, I'm Ken McCoy.